Hi, this is Anna. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'd like to share with you my last little golden book uh, Halloween journal. So that's the front cover. The back. Here's the spine. This book doesn't come with the, with the tassel as you can see, but it's the um, buttons give some decoration and black buttons because of Halloween and uh, maybe not necessarily black but dark for sure orange color threads and then the fabric see those spiders in between finished with a ribbon so that's how it looks for signatures um, the original book pages in first and last signature very cute paper look at these little witches stamping a lot of book pages i left the threads as you can see and you can trim them tuck spot pretty page there's a spider here's another journaling card I'm looking at something here About this some extra just like this red here stamped paper you can cut this into smaller pieces and uh, add descriptions to your pictures all removable double-sided Again, this, if you had a picture somewhere and uh, you glued picture, you can glue this and write description right here. You can journal about this picture. That's ex ex extra <laughs> ephemera to decorate things with. Happy Halloween. You can even um, attach it to a gift if you're gifting something for, for Halloween. Tax spot, but you can also use it uh, for pictures. Here's that spider. fabric trims here's this cute paper Here's also fabric.
And th because this is upside down, I have this here upside down as well. I thought it was fun. October old uh, calendar pages. Extra ephemera and uh, stamped paper. Here also notes. Of course, you can you can glue it somewhere in a journal. Or you can journal how to make Witch's Brew, for example. Doesn't matter what kind of brew it is. Super cute. Look at all this candy here. This is just decorations. Um, these are decorations on the mantle, I think. That's a belly band with a loose uh, vintage book page and then some cool ephemera. And this is just a little cluster of papers that you can use somewhere. Middle of the journal, here is a little tag with tuck spot. Again, it can serve as uh, space for pictures. Here's a spider, so there are Ex um, exactly same spiders on the other side and spider web right here so guess check again ideas for Halloween crafts Femora here. And a couple tags. This can be a journaling card or you can make it into a, a tag or something. Mushrooms. Mushroom with a spider web. Sorry, silk and um, ephemera. Very cool textured paper with um, this is glitter around the circles. Cats. Again, crafting ideas. Fabric. There are the mushrooms and more spider webs. And here, 
bad ideas, <laughs> so beware. And then the tag here, all removable owls at the back. And this uh, pretty golden color leaf. It's a, actually a very pretty page, I like this page. Here again, crafting ideas. That's really cool. And then paper to journal on. You can see the stamping through it. Punched paper. So as you can see, um, Paper pad, no digitals. Look at this. How cool is this? This is really a great idea for crafts. Fabric. And this is last signature. So it's bingo card here. Tag with blue butterfly. And this one, um, this here is um, the vintage treat, Halloween treat bags. I like this page too, actually. Very cool Halloween paper, double sided. Fabric. That's a tuck spot. So this you could make into a journaling card. You could glue it in a journal and then glue this on top and journal here and journal around it. It's also a pretty page. I love these houses. Look at these Halloween houses. You could um, you could just make it with paper on, um, just glue it to a page. You would just cut out white, and then black for the roof, black for the window, orange. Um, very easy to just put it on a paper, piece of uh, sheet of paper. So you don't have to do them uh, three-dimensional. And I don't have anything here. Will this fit? This postcard. I need scissors. I'll have to uh, cut the uh, side a little bit and I'll include it in this paper bag. And here to do list and tags and also Tim Holtz ephemera. Here's uh, look at this using Oreos. You can make this dragon or. Um, I don't know if it's dragon. I think it is because it has these things here. 
for Halloween, for, I don't know, Halloween kids party or something. And more bags right here. And that's a tuck spot. And this is also fabric. A lot of blue in this book, I love it. And here are a couple of lips, so you can journal here, you can take these off because they're on washi on both sides. So you can move them around, you can put them somewhere else in the journal. And that's it, the ribbon here, spider web. And it's pretty full as you can see, but there's still stuff, I guess, to add pictures because then you will be removing certain things and adding things, so. But it is pretty full. So thank you so much for joining me to watch this video. Please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.